using lab on a chip technology stanford engineers have created a micro lab half the size of a credit card that can detect covid-19 in just 30 minutes throughout the pandemic infectious disease experts and frontline medical workers have asked for a faster cheaper and more reliable covid-19 test now leveraging the so called lab on edge chip technology and a cutting edge genetic editing technique known as crispr researchers at stanford have created a highly automated device that can identify the presence of the novel coronavirus in just a half hour the micro lab is a microfluidic chip just to half the size of a credit card containing a complex network of channels smaller than the width of a human hair The new COVID-19 test is detailed in a study published in the journal Proceedings of the National Academy of Sciences. This test can identify an active infection relatively quickly and cheaply. It is also not reliant on antibodies like many tests which only indicates if someone has had the disease and not whether they are currently infected and therefore contagious. The micro lab test takes advantage of the fact that coronaviruses like SARS-CoV-2, the virus that causes COVID-19, leaves behind tiny genetic fingerprints wherever they go in the form of strands of RNA, the genetic product of DNA. If the coronavirus's RNA is present in a swab sample, the person from whom the sample was taken is infected. To initiate a test liquid from a nasal swab sample is dropped into the micro lab which uses electric fields to extract and purify any nucleic acids like rna that it might contain the purified rna is then converted into dna and then replicated many times over using a technique known as isothermal amplification Next the team used an enzyme called CRISPR Cas12 a sibling of the CRISPR Cas9 enzyme associated with this year's Nobel Prize in Chemistry to determine if any of the amplified DNA came from the coronavirus if so the activated enzyme triggers fluorescent probes that cause the sample to glow Here also electric fields play a crucial role by helping concentrate all of the important ingredients the target DNA the CRISPR enzyme and the fluorescent probes together into a tiny space smaller than the width of a human hair dramatically increasing the chances they will interact This chip is unique in that it uses electric fields to both purify nucleic acids from the sample and to speed up chemical reactions the team created its uh, device on a soothing budget of about $5000 for now the dna amplification step must be performed outside of the chip but the researchers expect that within months they will integrate all the steps into a single chip Several human scale diagnostic tests use similar gene amplification and enzyme techniques but they are slower and more expensive than the new test which provides results in just 30 minutes other tests can require more manual steps and can take several hours the researchers say their approach is not specific to covid-19 and could be adapted to detect the presence of other harmful microbes such as e coli in food or water samples or tuberculosis and other diseases in the blood the researchers are working with the food motor company to further integrate the steps and develop their prototype into a marketable product